In a heartfelt and emotional encounter, the Princess of Wales, Catherine, shared a deeply touching moment with a mother whose teenage daughter tragically took her own life. During her visit to Maidenhead Rugby Club, Catherine expanded her campaign to emphasise the critical importance of the early years in a child's life with a particular focus on the roles of fathers. Amidst her visit, Catherine met Sarah Renton, a devoted mother of three and coach for the Maidenhead Under-14s team. Sarah's talented daughter, Izzy, sadly passed away at the age of 17. In a heartfelt gesture, Sarah presented the princess with a pair of star-shaped earrings created by her cousin in memory of Izzy. Overwhelmed with emotion, Catherine embraced Mrs Renton tightly and promised to wear the earrings. The significance of the earrings extended beyond their beautiful design. The proceeds from their sale would be donated to Brave Minds, a mental health charity supporting children through rugby clubs. Mental health is an issue close to Catherine's heart and she recognised its importance. Izzy was a remarkable young woman who brought joy to everyone she met. She excelled academically, achieved success in her A-levels and even secured a place in an elite rugby programme. Her accomplishments included playing touch rugby for England and earning a gold medal in the summer. However, beneath her vibrant exterior, she struggled with depression, finding everything more challenging than it should have been. Sarah acknowledged that they believed Izzy was doing better than she actually was. Their journey highlighted the need for improved support systems, including GPs, medication and a network of assistance. Izzy found herself in a vacuum and her passing affected many parents and children at the rugby club. Together, they are working through the pain, supporting one another. The promise to wear the earrings showcased Catherine's passion for her work and her dedication to making a difference. Her visit to Maidenhead Rugby Club, donning a rugby top, tracksuit bottoms and trainers, symbolised her commitment to the cause. She was warmly welcomed by Nigel Gillingham, the CEO of the RUF, and Stephen Burrow, Maidenhead's chairman. Hugo Monet, a former player and champion for Catherine's Shaping Us campaign, joined her at the club. The campaign emphasises the importance of childhood experiences for children under five years old. On the pitch, Catherine enthusiastically participated in a rugby drill, although she had to be reminded that it was a walking-only exercise. Her athleticism shone through as she caught and threw the ball, impressing her teammate Courtney Lores. Inside the club, Catherine engaged in a discussion with players, including Lores and Danny Kerr, about their experiences as fathers. Cy Trower, the founder of mental health charity Brave Mind, joined them to explore the challenges and support needed during the early stages of parenthood. Catherine recognised the lack of information available to guide new fathers and stressed the importance of social and emotional development during a child's formative years. The princess highlighted that non-verbal years are crucial as teenagers can express their emotions more easily. She cautioned against over-medicalising mental health and emphasised the need to focus on the social and emotional well-being of young children. Catherine inquired about the support available to parents for their children's development, highlighting the challenges faced by first-time parents in accessing information. Catherine empathised with parents who may not have had positive childhood experiences themselves and may struggle in raising their own children. She emphasised the importance of providing support to families and communities to ensure that they can offer the best possible care. Every parent wants to do their best, but not everyone has the lifelines of family or community support. Before departing, Catherine posed for photographs with professionals and club players, showcasing her genuine connection with the rugby community. Her visit coincided with new research from the Prince's Centre for Early Childhood, revealing that while 24% of women consider the pregnancy to five-year-old period crucial, only 14% of men share the same sentiment. Princess Catherine's promise to wear the star-shaped earrings and her dedication to raising awareness of mental health demonstrate her compassion and commitment to making a difference. By shining a light on the significance of the early years and the role of fathers, she continues to inspire positive change and support for families across the country.